Welcome to Salt and Storytime. Today we're going to be reading a book called Growing Season. This book is written and illustrated by Marianne Coca Leffler and is about two best friends. I look forward to reading this book with you all today. Now let's get ready for story time. Growing season. Best friends Elle and Joe were the smallest students in the class. Even their names were short. Elle, Joe, Theodore, Harris, Genevieve, Sabina. Elle and Joe were always together. They sat next to each other in their just right sized desks and helped each other reach the unreachable. You're like two peas in a pod. On picture day, Elle and Joe were front and center. Everyone say Daisy. They played perfect twin elves in the holiday show and were small enough to share the special reading chair. But in springtime, something big happened. Joe grew. Joe, you're growing like a weed. When it was Joe's turn to water the plants, she didn't need Elle's help. And Joe's just the right size desk was not the right size anymore. Elle felt smaller every day. On the last day of school, Mr. Diaz told everyone to take a flower home and care for it over the summer. All the kids rushed to the window seal. They reached over Tiny L, grabbing all the flower pots with colorful blooms. Aww. There was only one pot left for L. It was small with no flowers at all. I know just how you feel, little plant, said L. Mr. Diaz leaned in. L. That's an aster plant. Aster means star. It's no star. It's just a little plain green plant, said L. Just you wait. In time, it will grow and have beautiful purple blooms, said Mr. Diaz. L was not so sure. Joe looked over at L's sad plant and then at her own. You can have my zinnia plant, said Joe. I'll be at my grandma's all summer anyway. I'll plant Aster and Zinnia side by side, said Elle. They will be best friends just like us, said Joe. Elle smiled. When Elle got home, she carefully planted the flowers in the garden. It was growing season. All summer long, she watered them and talked to them. Aster, why can't you be more like Zinnia? Summer became the waiting season. Elle waited for Aster to bloom. And she waited for Joe to return. Elle, I miss you. How is Aster and Zinnia, Joe? Hi, Joe. Zinnia is beautiful. See photo. Aster is still green. Maddie says hello. Elle, we are waiting. It is very hot. Happy summer from Joe. Waiting is hard, Elle. Elle, summer is almost over. See you soon. Tell Maddie I went fishing on a boat. Love, Joe. On the last day of summer, Joe came home. Yay! Elle and Joe ran straight to the garden and suddenly stopped. Something big had happened. Aster had finally bloomed. Aster and Zinnia. And so had Elle. Look, they're the same size now. The end. Thank you so much for reading Growing Season with me today. I look forward to reading more stories with you, so don't forget to like and subscribe. Have a wonderful day.